Jordan, and today's episode is Super Sweet Sugar X! Sugar! Sugar is one of my favorite things, and it's both hackable and snackable. I mean, it rocks, literally, when you hack sugar into rock and rock candy. For this, you'll need a pot, a spoon, a mason jar, a thermometer, a clothespin, Kool Aid, skewer stick, one half cup of water and two cups of sugar. Mix the sugar and water in the pot. Have an adult cook it until it gets to 230 degrees. This helps start the crystallization of the rock candy. Let it cool a little. Add Kool-Aid powder for color and flavor. Pour it into the mason jar. Dip the skewer into the jar and roll it in a little more sugar. Pinch the stick with the clothespin and suspend it into the jar. Check after about four hours. Pull it out and hang it over an empty jar to dry. This candy rocks! What common food is being researched as a fuel for cars? Sugar! So let's hack some pure power pellets with these DIY for this you'll need Kool-Aid, a syringe, and I got this from Liquid Medicine, molds or an ice cube tray, two tablespoons of corn syrup, a spoon and a bowl, gummy bears, and powdered sugar. Sprinkle some powdered sugar into the molds. Stir the Kool-Aid powder into the corn syrup. Suck it up into the syringe. Separate one color of gummy bears into the bowl. Have an adult microwave it for you. And be careful, it can get hot. Now spoon the melted gummy bear into the molds. Now inject the liquid candy into the gummy bear. Put it in the refrigerator to cool. As it cools, the gummy bears will harden, but the liquid candy stays runny. Pop them out of the mold and you have Gushers! What super duper sugary treat was actually invented by a dentist? Cotton candy! For this you'll need a pot, two cups of sugar, half a cup of corn syrup, half a cup of water, a roasting rack, wire cutters, a whisk, food coloring, vanilla extract, a spoon, lollipop sticks, salt, a thermometer, and hot mitts. Mix the sugar, water, and corn syrup into the pan and just a pinch of salt. Now stir it up. Have an adult heat it to 300 degrees, stirring constantly. Use the wire cutters to snip off the end of the whisk. If it has a plastic coating, take it off. Spread out the fingers till it looks like this. Add a couple drops of food coloring and a dash of vanilla. Dip the ends of the whisk in the syrup. Drip it back and forth across the rack. Wrap the strings around the lollipop stick. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed these sugary treats. But maybe not all at once. I think I'd better go brush my teeth. Have you ever ate so much sugar you felt sick? Tell me about it in the comments below. Remember to subscribe to DreamWorks TV and ring that bell so you'll never miss a hack. And to click here for more life hacks for kids with me, Jordan.